WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this uh, 20th day of Je- 19th day of January. We don't want to give January too many days here. 19th day of January, Friday. Tiger Financial News Network, 10 a.m. market update. Uh, the futures this morning in the Dow were just soaring up into the plus 200s. Then there was a sharp pullback. And now we've just got some 10 o'clock news and the market's bouncing again up 111 for the Dow. Uh, stuck in this rectangle formation uh, for quite some time since, uh, since about the third week of December. We've just been in the same range. Uh, but look at this. The S&P, so the Dow's up 87 to 37,553. The S&P is almost about to take out the 47.9330. No, it did already. 4802.40 high. Um, that was of a few days ago. It got to 47.99.33. Now struggling a little bit. It's also in this rectangle side. It's been really a high-level consolidation. Leg B in the month in the weekly chart. That's really important. Leg D in the month. We'll talk about that when I get back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Look at the QQQ. Very strong earlier. Uh, what happened there? QQQ up at 415.84, all time high. Now, is this really a leg B or is this an alternate count? Doesn't matter. It's very good action. The technicals are all strong and the bank defined across positive. Where we close today is going to be important. Where we are about Tuesday or Wednesday of next week is going to be really important, not just for January, but for February as well. G slash C, or maybe just plain old C in the weekly chart. Leg B in the monthly, that says the Qs can't make a new all-time high until way into uh, 2024. Let's go to the IWM. That's been the laggard, but today it's trying its best to turn around. IWM is trading right now. This is the Russell Small Caps, to Russell 2000, down 55, just making lower lows and lower heights. Can't get out of its own way. Talk about can't get out of its own way. Gold is up eight. It was up much, much more earlier on, pulling back a little bit. The dollar is actually holding quite well. It is up six ticks um, at 103.46. Uh, the TLT is uh, down a little bit. And let's see what crude oil is. Crude oil is down. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians. I'll check out my opening call, daily newsletter. See you in a few.